Shahid, what was your experience like? Uh, first of all, are uh, photo? Are photo? Hello, hello, yeah. <laughs> first of all, uh, good noon, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, the thing that I like the most about going uh, to Britain is that it's a direct flight. I love the fact that you get on a plane and you land where you want to be. Um, so it's extremely convenient. I really like that. Um, you know, I actually discovered how beautiful the countryside was pretty much in and around as we shot for this film, Shandar. Uh, we pretty much shot all, the, all of the film in uh, Britain. And like Alia said, we shot in Leeds. But we used to travel a lot here and there. As you can see, there's a lot of uh, beautiful castles. Uh, it, it's supposed to be one castle, but it's actually a few because uh, our uh, director Vikas Bell wasn't satisfied with just one. So he helped us discover a few castles uh, in and around the countryside in Britain. It's extremely beautiful. The weather was absolutely fantastic when we shot. It did get uh, cold towards the second half, uh, but in the months of August and September, it's amazing weather. Um, it's extremely green, extremely lush, the roads are fantastic, so, um, you know, driving around is really, really convenient. Uh, you have trains as well, so you can actually get anywhere you want very, very easily. It's not a problem, it's not a hassle at all. And, you know, when films are made, there's a lot of stuff that needs to go from point A to point B uh, with very little time to spare. Uh, so it was extremely convenient, very, very beautiful. Uh, I don't think Shandar would have been the fairy tale romance, like Alia said, that it needs to be without the wonderful beautiful countryside uh, that uh, Britain has. So we've really been privileged to uh, have shot there and we're very happy to be here and to be talking about it because we truly had an amazing time uh, shooting the film and, and it's truly been uh, memorable and it's really something that I will cherish for a long time because this is probably one of the most beautiful looking films that I've done and I think uh, the countryside of Britain did complete justice to that.